excitement and cheers filled the ice rink at the Salvation Army Croc Center as the young players skated across the ice in this year's California State Games. Ice hockey is a whole sport in itself. You know, it's intense, it's, it's aggressive, and it really kind of carries on to the fans as well. This is the first time many of the players have been able to compete in nearly two years due to the pandemic. They didn't get to come last year, and so this is the first year back. And many of these teams from Northern California, um, they have really have the chance to even practice together. So this is just a great opportunity for them to get out here and compete and kind of just play with their buddies. They're so excited. 78 teams competed this weekend for their chance to advance to the medal games. I just thought this was going to be a normal tournament. I had no idea until yesterday, so yeah. It's pretty fun, though. Uh, I'm having a lot of fun here with uh, these two. It's pretty exciting to be here. Miriam, Maggie, and Daphne play for the California Heat. The girls say it feels good to compete in a typically male-dominated sport. It feels good destroying them and putting them back in their place, you know? Yeah. The California State Games is an Olympic-style competition. The organization has been based in San Diego for more than three decades. Organizers say over the years, the competition has helped boost the San Diego economy. We have thousands of athletes, 78 teams, so you can imagine how many kids that is. And then in the summer games, we have well over 10,000 athletes. So combine that with our coaches and their parents, you know, we're bringing a, a huge economic boost in the summer to the area. So we're really proud to be able to do that and be able to do it again since the pandemic. Nate Holmes, ABC 10 News.